versus has ended, but Powerline is here. What is up guys, the Wilson Wildcard. We are back with another video. And today we're gonna be covering the main parts of the brand new Powerline promo. So here, this is a new concept type promo that we haven't seen in Madden Mobile 20. We've got eight events surrounding the middle event, which once we finish all eight events, we'll get an achievement pack. I saved one event for last to do with you guys here today. But before we do that, let's go ahead and look at the players we can get. Our two grandmasters, middle linebacker AJ Green, and a scheme select offensive tackle Jake Matthews. You get AJ Green by completing the Saquon and Kenny Galladay masters that we will cover in a bit. And for Jake Matthews, we need to get any three 100 overall power line masters. These are the power line masters. We got Ryan Jansen, Joe Tooney, Jared Cook, Kenny Galladay, but a cornerback, and Saquon as a linebacker. Now, you may be thinking, these requirements seem easy. You need a 40 negative charge badges and the 98 Saquon to get 100 Saquon, but it's a bit more complicated than that. If you scroll down to get 98 Saquon, you need the 95 Saquon and 30 negative charge badges. To get the 98 Sa 95 Saquon, you need this five negative charge badges and like nine team of the decade players so i find this a bit tough to grind because there's only four days in the promo itself but i will be doing my best and if i get that far i'm going for kenny galladay right now so if i do end up getting the 100 i will be making a new video uploading you guys uploading the video for you guys but basically, this is the main part of the promo. I am 290 overall Team of the Decade players away from the 95. Then I can move on to the 98. So these blitzes that we have in the main screen, they usually give one or two 80 overall Team of the Decade players. The first wins give power cells, which you need to complete the sets. And there is, and uh, you get a chance at a charge badge. The charge badges are actually rarer than you would expect. So we're gonna finish this final power line event. I'm gonna open some packs that I have saved. And yeah, we'll see where this takes us. Alright guys, we just finished the event and as you can see, this achievement pack is saved up. We'll open that later. We'll also open this later because I have some, I, I saved like four of the packs just so we can do a pretty big pack opening. I'm not going to do any open alls because I want to see if I can get lucky and actually end up pulling something good. So we start off with... 280 overalls. Something tells me these first few packs are just going to be 80 overalls. Here we get a negative charge badge. Okay, that's good. These are, you only get a chance at getting those, so that's a good pull. Here we get another negative charge badge. And a positive charge one this time. Now, here's our achievement pack. These, I've seen people pull 90s from these. I've, I've seen people pull nothing over an 85, so I'm hoping for good luck. Yeah, two positive charge badges. Josh Rosen. Three negative charge badges. DJ Chark, an 85 plus, okay. Andy Lee, and another 85 plus. 
So we get two 85 pluses from that. That is actually not bad considering these achievement packs. But anyway guys, that is it for this video. This is the main point of Powerline. So starting from the day this video is uploaded, you have four days, yes, four days to do your best to get our grandmasters here, AJ Green and Jake Matthews. Well, I wish you guys luck, but that is it for the video. See you guys soon.